ben Marlou en uh, ik wil graag een hidden hairstyle, zoals ze dat noemen. Dus um, aan de ene kant achter um, blauw tinten. Yeah. Yeah. Um, maar dan als ik het los heb, dat je het niet gelijk ziet. Yeah. Marlou wants hidden colors in haar hairstyle. She wants to stay long. And uh, when you uh, see her now, now she is normal. You don't have to see all the colors right at the first sight. Yeah. Will you turn for you and the rest of the world to show how your hair is now? And it's the first time you're modeling for me. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> and you came here by my son. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, uh, I washed the hair before because there was uh, a little bit silicone based product on and I'm, what I'm going to use uh, toners to make uh, ultra uh, lights but also special colors in the hidden uh, version. I need to wash the hair before. So now I'm going to dry it and then we're going to apply the color. Now the hair is not totally dry but the underlayers are dry. So now I'm going to apply that on the fontanelle. So we did because hidden colors are not laying on top. They lay under the skull bone. So my first line is on the skull bone straight. Then apart the hair. Same I do on the other side. From the ear. Over the skull bone to the other side. Pin it up with my chopsticks. So I have a lot of space to work on. Controlling the line, it's about a half centimeter higher. So now I'm going to apply the colors and I'm laying the, on the plastic foil. The colors I'm going to use are this brand. I love the brand because it smells wonderful, it's just on plant base and uh, it's uh, without oxygen, so you can use it straight from the box. Start in the first centimeter, lay the hair up, the colors I'm going to use are this brand, I love the brand because it smells wonderful, it's just on plant base and uh, it's uh, without oxygen, so you can use it straight from the box. Start in the first centimeter, lay the hair up, even when I work with the protection for my cape I use the first with the plastic foil. Start with the blue, it smells good. Yeah, <laughs> very fruity. <Yeah. laughs> Take every time about a centimeter or five. Come with a violet, start in the blue. Come with a green. And the last one is pink. Take a new foil on it. These foils are available by Lanza. Checking my clubs if they are not dirty because then I would have colors that I don't want on the hair. And copy the lines I just made. So starting with the blue. Take a rich amount. Now lay the foil flat. 
I'm on my first five centimeters. Then I take my purple and especially the purple smells also nice. <laughs> Purple's always good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Love purple. Green. Watching where my pink starts. And that's the nice thing about plastic foils, you can see where you left or started. And so I do the neckline. Now I've got all the colors on her hair. That's a cover up for certainly. I'll wait for uh, 20 minutes, then rinse it out. And then I'm back and I'll show you how I cut this hair with a hot scissor. It will be long, stays long, but this is the only way to do this. We'll be back. Okay, we're back. They're ultra transparent colors. It's very nice, especially because she has a blonde color. You don't want hard colors in it. Otherwise I would have bleach there and then it would look totally different. Just a little side shave. On this side. Then I'm going to correct a bit. <laughs> so uh, see I the see blue spot. <laughs> The blue spot I take away with the color uh, color off product. Now the length of hair I'm going to cut with a hot scissor. In her case, I start on the back. And then I'll show you also the colors they are in, so that you can see them. Part hair of the center line. The hot scissor is a TCC1 of Jaguar. And I put it on 130 degrees. And she wants to keep the hair as long as possible, so I only take off the ends. Yeah. It's fun, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you can see that the colors are laying in line with each other, and that you can see because when the words are look similar but they aren't they're dry they plop out I cut the hair on one length from the part behind the ear so from ear to ear it's all the same length then the front has a little bit layers, but not much. So that I'm going to control from the front, because otherwise I can't see it. They are nicely falling over the skull. The natural roundings. Putting the hair straight down.
So now all the hair on the back is cut, so now I go to the front. And there you can see the difference between lengths. It's not much, but it's the dry end that's sticking out. You better take away because then it, the hair does grow. With a hot scissor you only have to cut uh, twice a year and your hair don't uh, get damaged at the ends so it grows all the length that it grows and in a half year uh, with our hair it's about one half centimeter a month and then only a half centimeter has to come off because then you have uh, healthy hair again <laughs> I see some blue yeah <laughs> So far the cutting, so now I'm going to dry her hair. I want to give her hair some volume, so I use a beach spray of Attitude. So I get a product even. Yeah, get it now. A yarn. Yeah. Oh, they're really good. Yeah. It's renewed. This product will come through the hair. Before I go to dry it, the first take away the color is still on the skin. Okay, now I'm going to blow dry it. So I first pin up some parts of her hair because otherwise you have too much hair on the back. Start uh, with blow drying with a large brush. The product I'm going to use now is a flower related product, it's of Lanza. It don't is uh, greasy, it's just a wonderful product that protects the color and it smells uh, as all the Lanza mm. products do does. Very, very exciting, beautiful, soft. Now she has her hidden uh, color. Mm -hmm. oh, it's My love, you might show your hair to the world. <laughs> it's hard to do. Yeah, hard to do. Maybe when you yeah. take it all up, yeah. you can see it. <sighs> yeah, Still we, not right. Yeah, we see the color. <laughs> Will photos will uh, give the answers. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for modeling. You're welcome.